bet he wasn't in the script. Have you read all three scripts? <laughs> Touche. Howdy, folks. Welcome on back to you, me, and the movies. And it's time to scream once more. Wes Craven's coming back with Scream 3. Oh, boy. The third chapter in the Scream franchise. Check out this shirt. She's got her Scream shirt on. One of our fans sent this. Woo! Thank you to whoever it was. Yeah. I don't know if we had a name for that one. I don't think we did. It was one of the nameless shirts we got. But it's a cool shirt. I like the colors. Yeah, good colors on it. Mm -hmm. So what's going to happen in Scream 3? More people dressed up as the Grim Reaper. Ghostface. That's the name That's of his name, killer. Ghostface. Yeah. More people dressed up as Ghostface killing probably, what's her name? Sydney. Trying to kill Sydney. Do you think it's going to be Dewey as the killer this time? Yeah. For sure. Putting that prediction out there right now. Because I think that was been your like most solid prediction in every, <laughs> every watch He's we've done. He's just so weird. And then at some point, like it... The, the stressors of all of this. Oh, have, he's going to snap. He's going to snap. snap. Yeah, right? Yeah. Well, should we jump in and find out? Absolutely. Let's do it. Oh, but first, oh. this video is brought to you by The Coldest Water. Ooh. Visit thecoldestwater.com. Use code YMTM. Get 10% off your order. All right. Get yourself a nice water bottle or a, a mug like I got. Or she's got a koozie right there for her bottle. Check it out. Thecoldestwater.com. Use code YMTM. Go get yourself something nice to keep your cold drinks cold. Right. Also, like, comment, subscribe. Come hang out with us, especially tonight, because yeah. we're watching Scream. Yeah. And check out our Patreon link down below if you want to make early access, get full-length commentaries, or access to polls to make help us pick what we watch next. Link's down below. Check it out. <laughs> You're so Okay, let's start it over from, from <laughs> with that. But... <laughs> you started it over. You just had a stroke. You okay? <laughs> <laughs> but first like comment subscribe come hang out with us we're watching scream tonight yeah check out our patreon link down below if you want early access to our videos full-length commentaries access to polls to help us pick what we watch next links down below check it out <laughs> let's watch let's, scream three let's watch scream three here we go <laughs> holy mackerel it's a loud one what Hello? Hello? Who's this? Who's this? Who are you calling? Oh, wait a minute. I, I know your voice. You sound a lot like that guy on TV. Um, I thought this was going to be like a reverse scream. Why don't you tell me who you are? Ooh, you're a naughty boy, Cotton. Now, what would your girlfriend say? What makes you think I have a girlfriend? I know you do. I'm right outside her bathroom door. Let's play a little game. Answer right your girlfriend lives, and so wrong she dies. Oh. Or you lay a finger on Christine, and I swear to God I'll kill you. Wrong answer. No, wait. Hey! Get out of the way! She just hit me! So he's using a girl now, too, for the voice? Uh oh. Cotton, is that you? Not cotton. Why are you still wet? Maybe she peed a little. Who puts on clothes when they're still wet? Okay, cotton. You know I don't like your stab games. Who is it? Who's there? Christine? Han, you alright? I'm home! Jesus, you scared the <laughs> out of me. I'm not gonna believe what just happened to me. What are you talking about? Shit, 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 shit. Christine, get out of the way! Oh. Behind you! Oh. It was a simple game, Cotton. You should have told me where Sydney was. Now, 
you lose. Who the hell could be looking for Sydney now? Well, at least you don't have to worry about it being cotton this time. It's true. Dewey's finally snapped. He's looking for Sydney. How'd she land a place like this? Movie rights? Probably movie rights. There is a young man outside who wants to see you. He says he's with the police. The police? Dewey! Young man? Detective Mark Kincaid, LAPD. Uh, Quite oh. Quite impressive resume. Thank you. I assume you're not here for an autograph? I'm here because Cotton Murray's been murdered. Again, not young man, but... This is Maureen Prescott. This is Cindy Prescott's mother. Hollywood is reeling today from news of the murder of controversial talk show host Cotton Murray. Where he was your goddamn idea, guys. All right, an ex-con with a trashy talk show? He must have pissed people off every day. Can't Detectives. There's no reason to presume that Cotton's death had anything to do with this movie, is there? He was making a movie called Stab. He was Stab. <laughs> Good one. Well, Tyson, that'd make you next, wouldn't it? I am not a Randy substitute. Jenny huh? McCarthy. <laughs> Gail Weathers. Oh, my God. Uh, listen, I, I, I know we've never met. And I, I don't... <laughs> To tell you after two films i feel like i am in your mind mm, well that would explain my constant headaches <laughs> you have to... are you parked in the lot because i should check to make sure that nobody's messed with your brake line <laughs> what you're not coming here to fight with you do we i mean what ca what went wrong she went with him to the hospital at the end of the last one well, does Sydney know about it? Listen, Sydney doesn't need you and your camera in her life. Oh, do you see a camera? <clears throat> right. You bought me this purse, didn't you? Yeah. Get that woman out of here. Yes, Mr. Milton. Wait Let's do it. Wait a Where is Detective Kincaid? I am working with Kincaid, Dewey. Whatever stylist picked that haircut for Courtney Cox did not do her any favors. Yeah, those those bangs are hideous. Extremely short bangs. Hey, Connie, how's Maury? <laughs> oh, man. The only people you talk to don't even know your real name. It's as if you don't exist. That's kind of how she likes it. We don't like nightmares. Uh, yay, yay, yay. Oh, Jesus. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Sid, mother needs to talk to you. You're just like. Is that Dave Rock? <laughs> Damn it. Just goes to show your imagination's the scariest thing. Is it though? I would have for sure curbed it if I had tried to come in that hot. Parking a car. Even if you were driving slower, you probably still would have. Probably. Someone here? <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> ring, ring. Hello. Hello? Who's this? Who's this? This is Candy. Hang on, let me get some clothes. See? <laughs> <laughs> the whole shower thing's been done. Vertigo, hello. And I mean, my boyfriend just died. Why am I showering? Uh, why don't we just read the scene? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think there's a shower scene in Vertigo. I think she's thinking Psycho. Yeah, probably. It's not the line. It is in my script. Has there been another goddamn rewrite? <laughs> Minutes. It's not just a new script. It's a new movie. What movie? My movie. 
and it's called Sarah gets skewered like a pig. Still in character. Yikes. Oh boy. Sunrise Pictures releases, press four. If you'd like information about Sunrise Pictures merchandise, oh, come on. press five. He doesn't have a prop knife. Yeah, it's not the place you want to get your weapons, is it? Proper. Uh, now we don't get to see her die naked, though. It's Jennifer. She needs me. Jennifer? Gotta run. Wait, Dewey, where are you going? I'm on duty. So she follows him? Magneto? Uh, you left your motor running. <laughs> There's been a second murder. Who? Sarah Darling. Technically a third. Sarah Darling, don't you get it? Someone's killing them in the order they die in the movie. Dewey, who gets killed third? Who gets killed third? You do. So is she gonna die or is the actual The real Gale? Right. She says I'm her rock. Her rock? Yeah. If you weren't so concerned with pretensions and appearances, you'd be able to appreciate the positivity and emotional centeredness I provide a woman. <laughs> hmm. Same deal? Found with the body? Yeah, Maureen Prescott again. This is great. Did Maureen Prescott have, like, a son that nobody knew about? And now they're trying to... Or... or Another daughter, I don't know. Another child that's upset because Sydney got all the attention, or... Three versions. Three different characters die next. And we don't know which one the killer read. Super! TV. You know, I have no movie. I'm about to turn 30. And it looks like I'm now the next target. What? You? Why you? Do you think this wasn't a message? <laughs> This is the scene where you come with us. Do we, Jennifer? <laughs> so I'm pretty sure Jennifer is supposed to be like Jennifer Aniston. Right. Right. God, Roman. Remind me not to sleep with him again. <laughs> oh, goodness. It's crisis counseling. My name is Laura. How can I help oh, you? Laura, I do have a crisis. <laughs> That's the voice again. It's Mother Laura. Now be a good girl and turn on the news. And with the second cast member murdered, Stab 3 has been officially shut down. Just one question. Do you think it's over, Sydney? Do you? She needs a bunker. <laughs> girl needs a bunker with only one entrance and exit. She just needs to park in front of it, start shooting anybody who opens the door. Scaring me. Two people are dead. Scaring you? Ha! Three people are dead. Look who I found slinking around the yard. The nightly news. I wasn't slinking. I was walking. You were Why does everybody got to wear those black boots? Bodyguards wearing those black boots. Oh, they're popular. If I thought like a homicidal maniac, then I'd know how a homicidal maniac thinks. It's definitely Dewey. <laughs> The second story, there and there. It's the same. Oh my god, Marine Prescott was at the back line at Sunrise Studios. I gotta make some calls. Sounds like she tried to make it in Hollywood, huh? I feel like I'm not following very well tonight. I'm just checking your tin can, dude. Drop. Well, come back inside and stay with Jennifer. Something's happened. Hey, I'm just checking to make sure there's no killer in here waiting to off you like he did your little sister. What did you say? I can't believe you said that. That makes me... Angry! I 
bet he wasn't in the script. Have you read all three scripts? <laughs> Touche. Jennifer? Angelina? Tom? Holster it. <laughs> Everyone back inside. Inside, outside, inside, outside, inside, outside. The killer prepares to grant mercy to only one Don't of get them. It. The killer says he's outside because he wants his hair inside. Inside, outside, inside, outside. <laughs> I can't just say. Who's he running to? Runs to Gale. No! Oh, <laughs> oh, it's like black sheep all over again. Oh, he's gone already. Oh, sh Taking credit for Marine Prescott's murder here. But we, okay, look, we all know this has something to do with Stab 3, but what we do not know is why the killer keeps leaving pictures of Marine Prescott taken over 25 years ago. photographs taken at the same studio Stab 3 is shooting out of. What does this have to do with Sid? Who knows more about Maureen Prescott than her own daughter? Well, Sid's dad couldn't help you, and he was married to Maureen. The actress playing Sydney is weird. <laughs> she won a contest to get that role. Did you catch that? Mm -mm. Hi, you've reached the machine. You can leave a message. Talk as long as you want. Sid, is she already dead? Please pick up. Oh, there she is. I make sure you're... Okay. Sid. The killer called her. What? When? What do you say? Oh, you know, the usual small talk. Let's know how you've been. How do you want to die? Well, you could have monitored calls on a scanner. Did you call her from the set? No. Do you have her number stored in your memory? Phone memory. <laughs> give me a break. Yeah, give me a call. Just keep your eye on her. Dewey's wearing those boots. He has been the whole time. <laughs> All three movies? Yes. Tell me that's his ex girlfriend. I'll shoot myself. It's Martha Neek's Randy's sister. Randy's sister? Yeah, I get to tell. We miss you. <laughs> There's something you guys should see. Scary Movies 101. Well, if you're watching this tape, it means as I feared I did not survive these killings here at Windsor College. And that giving up my virginity to Karen Kolchak at the video store was probably not a good idea. Karen Kolchak? <laughs> yes, Karen Kolchak. <laughs> Creepy Karen? Shut up! She's... <laughs> <laughs> you are dealing with the concluding chapter of a trilogy. True trilogies are all about going back to the beginning so if it is a trilogy you are dealing with, here are some super trilogy rules. One, you got a killer who's going to be superhuman. Stabbing him won't work, shooting him won't work. Basically, in the third one, you got to cryogenically freeze his head, decapitate him, or blow him up. Number two, anyone, including the main character, can die. The past is not at rest. Any sins you think were committed in the past are about to break out and destroy you. Great. Because the rules say some of you ain't going to make it. I didn't. Not if you're watching this tape. Who's gonna die? Which one? You be careful. No way Courtney Cox, Cox comes back for a fourth one. Well, dude being the killer this time, he probably dies. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, that made my fingertips. <laughs> so now 
starting now, I go where you go. That way, if someone wants to kill me, I'll be with you. And since they really want to kill you, they won't kill me. So. <laughs> kind of makes sense to me, actually. <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> this photo was taken at the studio. Her name is Maureen Prescott. Back then, it was probably Roberts. Karen Fisher! Hey, you're... Are you no. But you look just. You like her. are. I was up for Princess Leia. I was this close. So who gets it? The one who sleeps with George Lucas. I I'm sorry, I didn't mean to bring up. <laughs> so how can I help you? Or do you want me to tell you who you look like? <laughs> Would you work for the president? The president of the studio. $50? Who are you? <laughs> Rena Reynolds. Stage name. You should talk, Judy Jurgenstern. <laughs> what? John Milton, the horror producer. Those were his movies. Did she sleep with the director and the, like, son or daughter of the director is really pissed off about it? Because it broke up the director's marriage? But you weren't expecting a Carrie Fisher cameo, huh? Nope. I mean, Bianca Burnett, sorry. Turns out Sydney isn't her... Her dad isn't her dad. It's like... Somebody else. Think so? I don't know. Black boots? Oh, shit. Girls' black boots. She's got a mask. I thought... Well, if there's no movie, then no one would care if I took some souvenirs. Souvenirs? Mm-hmm. Fishy. Fishy! Angelina. She's definitely working with somebody. You know, she's still wearing Jerry's letters. There's clearly more than one. That was a cush landing. It's not your mom. Don't do it. Give mommy a kiss and we'll make up. Sydney! What happened? Kincaid. Hey, there's nobody up here. Everyone's wearing those damn black boots. <laughs> what I mean, but he was there. He or she or whoever this is. We're going to take you back to the station. He was gone the whole time, too. The detective? He, yeah, he drove off doing his own damn thing. Where'd you go, buddy? He's watching, and he wants you. Everyone's wearing black boots. She was a bit player in a couple of my movies. A nobody. So what does it matter? Oh, come on. You have made millions off the story of her murder. You're obsessed with her, and you're obsessed with her daughter! All right, easy, Geraldo. <laughs> All I know about movie trilogies is that in the third one, all bets are off. Rena Reynolds' son. I don't know. To be watching a scary movie in your head, whether you want to or not. Watching it alone. He's creepy. Hey, detective. What's your favorite scary movie? My 
What's your favorite scary movie? Well, this one right now. <laughs> Riley here. Dewey, it's Sydney. Hey, Sid. I'm with Gail. We're on our way to see you. <laughs> Tell me something about my mom. I'm going to meet him at his house. Wait, Sid. I'm not so sure that's a good it's idea. It's okay. No. Kincaid's with me. I've got official big time LAPD protection. <laughs> but I'd feel better if you were there. That's not Sydney. It's not Sydney. Kincaid is not with her. Call her back. That's what they should have done. Damn minute. There's a psycho killer on the loose, and you want to go traipsing around this gigantic mansion? I'll have go you... with you, Roman. Here you go. You guys want to come? It'll be okay. Uh, we're going to stay here and wait for Sid. We'll be right back. I'm not supposed to say that. Ooh, it's spooky. Don't do it, Gail. It's a lot of weird. It's all his movies props. Yep, yep, it sure is. Mm hmm. Is this what he... A voice modulator that can sound like anybody, because that makes sense. All right. Take the gun. Go find Roman and Jennifer. I'm going to get the others. No, no, no. Just go. Leave the others. They are the others. Roman! Tyson! Angelina! Leave Angelina. She's definitely in on it. Great. What's wrong? Looks like Stab 3 is back in production. Oh god, I hate this. <laughs> Jennifer! Gail, you're definitely dying. At this point in timelines, they can afford David Arquette. They can probably not afford Courtney Cox. She's got to be the one that dies. Think so? Yeah. Roman's dead right there. <laughs> Don't go with her. She's a psycho. Nah, she's fine. She's in on it. We'll be safe if we stick together, won't we? Of course. Why? What? Oh! What's going on? Oh, oh Hey! Do it! Ah, please! Ah! Trap door! Oh, Who is this asshole? It's the cop. Get away from me! You don't scare me! Look, Gail. The mirror's moving. Shoot the mirrors. Shoot. Aim high. Aim, aim high. Oh no. Tyson! I'm gonna check down here. You call for help. No! Stop leaving each other! Oh my god! Oh my god, I hate this. No! Stop checking places! God damn it! Frustrating. 
Wait. How do I know that this is you, Gail, not the killer? How did they shut the door as they were falling down the steps? The stairs. No. <laughs> He's killing people at that mansion. Who is this? The question isn't who I am. The question is who's with me? Sydney, stay away! Sydney! Now, do you have somewhere we can be alone? Uh, weren't you just alone with her in your office? Don't you want to know who killed your mother? Sinking cake? Yeah, I saw him go out. Where? Uh, She'd have been so happy, Sydney, to know we'd be together. Where? I'll call you when you're on your way. Yep, brother. Why would she know where to go? She called him. To tell her where to go. Uh -huh. We just didn't see it. Throw it in the pool. Sid. Where is he? I don't know. He's right there! <laughs> Think again. It's your turn to scream, asshole. A lot of feathers just flew there. <laughs> Where is he? Always gotta double tap the head. Be careful. Cause he's a cop. He's got he's got a vest. Mm-hmm. There he is. Miss Prescott. I'm here to help. Put the gun down. Shoot him. Oh, damn it. Okay, but your friends are still out there. Who the hell are you? The other half of you. I searched for a mother, too. An actress named Rena Reynolds. Tried to find her my whole life. You were the only child she claimed, Sydney. She shut me out in the cold forever. Her own son. Oh, damn. That for sure was a cop. Your boyfriend didn't like seeing his daddy in my film too much. He didn't like it at all. Once I supplied the motivation, all the kid needed was a few pointers. This is all because of you. The director said, I had no idea that they were going to make a film of their own. Oh. All right, you're going to be all right. Uh. Just apply pressure. Yeah, take this. Get this son of a bitch. I still think he's involved. You still think he's involved? <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. Those boots. Come on, you guys. Figure it out. Yeah, that's gonna work. Leave her alone. Where is he? Bravo. Lose something. Found something. A prop gun or something. <laughs> Shooting blanks. I shot you. Oh, that 
that a girl? I guess we think alike. <laughs> Mother's dead. I still got to make my movie. Step three, right? <laughs> He's still involved, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Do you think so? <laughs> I don't know. Sure not. He was working with somebody else. <laughs> He's wearing a vest, so the... <laughs> pretty sure the impacts of the shot, even on a vest, though, would yeah, knock you on the ass. Yeah. yeah. But he's superhuman, so. This guy was not working alone. Gale and Dewey forever. What I'm asking is just to see if we're wrong. We don't know everything, Gale. I mean, you, you think you do, but... <laughs> <laughs> I know what that's like, Dewey. <laughs> We're going to start a movie. What kind of movie? You have to come and see. I think he's still involved. I think so. He's long conning her. That's what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> I can't be wrong. <laughs> he was so suspicious. You didn't even guess it was Roman once. No. <laughs> <laughs> Wes Craven had me going all different directions. You thought it was Angelina and I still think they were both Kincaid. involved. <laughs> I still think Angelina was involved. No, she was just an actress. No, there was more than one. There was like two people chasing her around that set. Think so? Yeah, because somebody was pushing on the door when he was outside the window. I think that was just the draft. Mm, I don't I still think there was few people involved yeah. there's always been more than one person involved there's always been i two. know but you gotta remember it's a trilogy no the there's third, a second person. third movie changes patrick things. dempsey's probably the separate second person he's just now playing the long con oh, he's playing a long con <laughs> yeah so you think it's scream four he's gonna <laughs> why else would they have a fourth her. one <laughs> yeah i can't even remember if i've seen i don't think i've seen scream four well it, i i barely be remember a this one great watch for both of us i remember the only thing I remember from this one is that they were filming the movie and that the killer was her brother, but I forgot if it was Kincaid or Roman. So Could have gone either way. I thought you were right on with Kincaid, but I think that he was the ultimate red herring. They're twins. They made it way too obvious. Twin brothers. That it was him watching it again and realizing it's not him. They're twin brothers. That made you want to think it was the detective. Yeah. But it wasn't. Kincaid is just a... They gave no clues that it was Roman. No, none at all. Yeah. So what'd you think? It was... I, it, these aren't bad. That's kind of the fun part about them. Like, they they don't get so god-awful unrealistic yeah. as they go, like, Freddy and Jason movies. Mm -hmm. Like, these are still... They could stand alone on their own pretty well, I think. Yeah. Obviously not as good as the first, but definitely still watchable. Good popcorn flick. Yeah. I'm not disappointed in this at good all. Good little try to solve the mystery of who the killer is. Yeah, kinda. yeah, yeah. Without, like, going overboard and cheese factor. Because mm -hmm. it starts out a little bit cheesy anyways. Yeah. So, I, I don't know. I just feel like they Wes Craven hit the nail, like, perfectly on the head. Poking fun at the genre, but still, like, yes. making a good film yes, in the genre. exactly. Yeah. 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 I like these a lot, actually. Yeah. I knew you would. I knew you would. Because the murder mystery are part of it, I think. Yeah, I mean, so far, in. I think this these this might be, like, my favorite. Is Scream your favorite scary movie? I think it might be, as far as, like, the ones that are, that have lots of, like, redos. Like a, yeah, uh, sequels? Yes, lots well, of sequels. Not counting, like, what would... Things that are other, sagas or trilogies what or would whatever. be your other favorite scary movie? Well, Doctor Sleep, but, Okay, yeah. You know. That's kind of a sequel, too, though. Yeah, kind I of I mean, is. it is a sequel, but... Yeah. But it's a totally different kind of movie, yeah. right? That's more like, yeah, it's just so different. But yeah. I really enjoy this. Yeah. Better than Freddy, better than Jason, better than Michael Myers. All right.
So you think Ghostface is the best slasher killer? No, I didn't say that. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say it was the best killer. I just said it was, I liked these more yeah. than the others. So what do you think of the aspect of them pull it? Like Randy shows up to give you the rules of the trilogy mm-hmm. saying something from your past is going to come back. I mean, you already kind of guessed it before Randy yeah. showed up that it was going to be like her long lost brother or something like that. But what do you think of them? Like It's called a retcon, right? Of Roman is actually the guy that convinced Billy to be the killer in the yeah. first one. What do you think of that aspect of this? The I don't plot? mind it. I mean, I think it's a stretch, but it's not, yeah. you know, it's rewriting the past to set up the story for this one. Exactly. Kind of thing, right? But at this point, like Jamie Kennedy's character, right? Like, yeah. like he said, that's kind of how, that's how trilogies work. Yeah. Oh. You can't really go anywhere but there in the third. So, I don't know. It makes sense. Yeah. Well, Dewey didn't get stabbed in this one. I know. Neither of them died. I'm really shocked because yeah. that broke Randy's rule. Somebody yeah, from somebody from the original, original should have died. Should have some, and yeah. nobody did. So, I don't know what yeah, to say the, about that. The, uh, the Trinity lived on. I wonder if they were planning on killing one of them, but people loved the, the Dewey, um, the Dewey Gale love story so they much just got like, married oh, too officially like i think during the filming of this film because this came out in 2000 they were married in 1999 so so there you go yeah it's a good there they have good little good on on screen chemistry yeah, yeah. on screen chemistry for sure what else is on your mind uh, how else does i mean how does this fit in everybody's scream yeah like not bad right mm-hmm. or Where scream or three stack up it? to the original two to you yeah exactly it's a it up to par i thought so i thought it was pretty good who is your favorite new character oh uh gail the fake gail <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> jennifer <laughs> um she's so good though like yeah. she's just funny the whole time when they're like running around together i know like, holding hands yeah. i loved it yeah. <laughs> loved it that was like that was definitely my my favorite new character out of mm. In this one, yeah. Parker Posey. Plus a Carrie Fisher cameo. Oh, I love Carrie Fisher cameos. Playing I'm not Carrie Fisher. Yes, yeah, so great. Bianca Burnett. <laughs> Even threw a little James Silent Bob in there, too. Yeah, love so it. They're having fun with the little pop ups here and there. Yeah, little cameos. So, yeah. What was your favorite kill? I can't remember. No. They're, all, they're all so similar. Yeah. They get stabbed. Yeah. Stab three. I think the blown up the house kill was pretty good. That was pretty cool, yeah. The other, the Dewey, who wasn't David Schwimmer in this. No. Nope. They couldn't get David Schwimmer to uh, reprise his role in Stab 3. <laughs> Bummer. Would have been funny if it was Jennifer Aniston and played Parker Posey, too. <laughs> <laughs> was she actually playing Jennifer Aniston? I don't no, know. No, she was just playing so. a girl named Jennifer. I think that it... they took her name, said she was dating Brad Pitt, right? Yeah, yeah. And then they were poking, fun, they were at poking it. fun at yeah. Jennifer, like with her character throughout the whole thing. So Absolutely. Kind of love that. Yeah. All the little friends references for Courtney Cox. Is yeah, pretty, pretty cool. great. So, all right. What should people comment on? Favorite kill. Favorite kill. Where did Fa- it line up? Favorite new character. Favorite new character. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Yeah. Thanks for hanging out. Also, Screen three. this video is brought to you by The Coldest Water. Check out thecoldestwater.com. Use code YMTM to get your 10% off your order. Go grab yourself a nice little mug or a water bottle or a koozie. Whatever you need to keep your water or your drinks nice and cold. Thecoldestwater.com. Use code YMTM. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.